What was that? Oh, yeah, I should probably make another video. What's up, Fancy Hats? Today, we're gonna make a game, but not just any game. It's gotta be bouncy. Taking a look at my favorite projects, you can see that it goes from Spider-Man games all the way up to weird smiley face games. But we're gonna look at this game right here in particular. Rebound is a game by Guastasauce. Based on the hit YouTuber Danny's ball game, it has all the bouncy ball action you'd probably ever need, with many effects, visuals, and the sweet neon colors. So why don't we create our own version of this game with a little twist. The first thing we need to do is change the title of the project. We'll just do Bouncy for now because it's really simple and easy. What's the first thing you need to do when making a game? You'd say probably Engine, but nope. We're going to make the title screen first because I don't know why I just always do this for some reason. So now that we have the title screen done with the shop, items, and even the height score system, let's start working on the next part of the game. For this next part, we gotta roll the dice, because when I was making the shop and inventory items, I had to like draw dice items so I'd know which one is which. Yeah, that, that's it. At this point, I'm getting bored of this game, so why don't we add some music so that I can get some motivation to work on it. And where better to get this music than by taking it from the game that we're basing it off of. Now that the title screen is done, I made the engine so that you can move up and down on these two lines and it, I just added a quick tutorial for new players. Taking a look at the background of Rebound, you can see that there's things falling in the background so why don't we add that to our game. To stop people from yelling at me, I made it from going right to left instead of up to down. I also added a glowing effect to the player and the lines and I added a new tutorial so that you can actually know how to play. Now since mugs don't really have brains, I couldn't really think of a name for this game, so why don't we just ask ChatGPT, that'll be way easier. How about subscribing to Mugcat so he can make more awesome devlog videos in the future? Yeah, very good advice, but not a good name, please give me another one ChatGPT. Okay, how about Color Blitz? It then corresponds to the colors of the game and make it tied with the fast paced acid topic to the game. Colors in the game give a glow on the amount of visual as part of the field and game loop. Blitz is typically used as a representation of fast paced gameplay. Okay, I did not ask for an entire essay, but sure, we'll use that name. But instead of Color Blitz, let's do Chroma Blitz. Just, it kind of sounds better anyways. So now I coded in the new logo that I made, and I made it so that it, like, moves up and down when you put your mouse over it. And I also added, instead of the things in the background going from right to left, it, it comes from both ways and meets in the middle. Now after adding many things and fixing tons of bugs, here's basically the final product without any updates, without any commentary. Now, after I release this video, it's probably been updated a lot more, so the link will be in the description, and we'll see you guys all next time, Fancy Hats. See you later.